friends, so today I'm doing my first empty bottle review. So I decided to start with my daily cleanser and that is the Burt's Bees Refining Cleanser. That's what the bottle looks like. And I use it every time I hop in the shower. So either it's at the end of the day, beginning of the day, if I have to get somewhere early, um, I will start with this, right? And so I'll hop in the shower, get it going, start with the cleanser and then, you know, tend to the rest of the items and so um, it's it's just something that I need to do at least once a day like I need to exfoliate my skin in some way otherwise I don't feel like I like I cleaned my face well enough that day <laughs> and if I put makeup on that day I'll use my like cleansing cleanser first if that makes sense so the cleanser that I use to remove makeup uh, I'll use that first and then immediately afterwards I'll use the Burt's Bees Refining Cleanser to exfoliate my skin and kind of get any of that makeup residue out of my pores. And so that's been really working really well for me, that combo. And if I only need to do one or the other, I'm definitely going to choose the Burt's Bees and exfoliate my skin. What's nice about the Burt's Bees Refining Cleanser is that you can use it and exfoliate your skin lightly before you do a sugar scrub or a mask and it won't make your skin too sensitive before you do either of those things. And so as far as if I ordered another one, I did. And so here is my new bottle. It's always funny to see your old bottles next to your new ones because you're like, oh yeah, it was like clean and you know, full at some point, <laughs> which is kind of cool. Those are my thoughts on Burt's Bees Refining Cleanser. If you're already a Grow Collaborative member, you can get it in your next Grow box. Um, so I'll have a few more empty bottle reviews coming up as things get used. Uh, I wanted to share that with you all and kick off this series. Thanks for watching. <laughs>